Hi, I am Dr. Suachla, Scientific Director with Ziva Fertility Centers. Can smoking cause infertility? Can it bring down your success rate, especially in IVF? Let's discuss this today. Well, to understand this, we have to see what studies have been done. And most of the studies have been done on IVF patients. Obviously, because when the eggs are removed out of the body, the fluid that comes along with the egg has been studied very well. The sperms that have been given for an IVF cycle for injection into the oocyte, for in, into the egg, has been studied in detail. So what they found was when they looked at uh, the egg from smokers versus non-smokers the smokers had a lot of nicotine around the fluid of the egg so around the egg there is a lot of follicular fluid we call it uh, there was a nicotine in 100% of these cases in non-smokers it was not present so this is a very important finding that was reported from IBF patients among the smokers and the non-smokers they also looked at people who are exposed to smokers so as a passive smoker if people are smoking around you would you be affected so when they looked at this and they uh, you know uh, asked this question to these uh, IVF patients they saw that non smokers were also who are exposed to passive smokers had nicotine in their follicular fluid so it was a very strange but shocking revelation that came into light that even if you are a passive smoker and you are exposed to people who are smoking around you at work or at home uh, you may be affected by the nicotine in around your egg and this brings down the fertilization rate the embryo formation rate the implantation of the embryo into the uterus rate so it's a very very critical thing and you should pay attention to the fact that smoking causes infertility we are seeing a lot of smoking in women uh, nowadays and uh, i would like to you know emphasize the fact that smoking causes irreparable damage to eggs so kindly understand that smoking will cause chromosomal damage to your eggs which is irreparable you can't reverse it even if you stop smoking so if you are in a reproductive age group you are going to plan pregnancy soon or later in the future also you are looking at uh, becoming a mother please quit smoking when it comes to men let's see what the studies have said so in the same cohort when they looked at uh, smokers versus non-smokers they saw that smokers had nicotine in their semen sample it was again as shocking as when they studied the uh, women's group so even in in this group when they looked at passive smokers people men who were exposed to people who were smoking around them they saw that nicotine was present in passive smokers who had uh, smokers around them so this also throws light on the fact that nicotine or smoking is not good for your fertility if you're exposed also to people around you are smoking please stop it try to avoid that and uh, bring up your chances of fertility and success at pregnancy if you have more queries if you want to understand more about this you are a smoking you are seeking help to quit smoking also we can counsel you we have uh, psychology counselors who will help you in uh, quitting smoking please feel free to contact us thank you a lot of effort has gone into making this video please like and subscribe us thank you